What's up, guys? Magic with RacingDudes.com here to talk to you about the Grade One Awesome Again Stakes, a Breeders' Cup winning year in for the classic. This race is at San Diego Park going a mile and an eighth under eight older males, and all eyes are going to be on Country Grammar, the runner up to Flightline in the Pacific Classic last time out. Uh, a big favorite in this race. You see four to five. Uh, Bob Baffert has four horses in this, trying to win it for the eighth time, which would be a record. He also has Azul Coast in here. He also has Defunded in here. Uh, he has High Connection, a three-year-old in here. There you see Slow Down Andy going in the gate. And we're off. High Connection, the three horse, did not break very well. That's right. I didn't have a high opinion of him in this race. Defunded's going to go to lead. Not a surprise. Edwin Maldonado getting on board for Bob Baffert. One of the best gate jockeys in California is Edwin Maldonado. And uh, when he teams up with a Baffert horse in a spot like this, he can be he can be kind of deadly. It's kind of like Manny Franco on turf horses for Chad Brown when he's got a few of them. If he's on a speed horse, eh, give that horse a look. Um, I was on express train. He's in a good position here. Country Grammar, uh, did, well, even Money Now is uh, the big favorite sitting fourth. Slow Down Andy, another horse with early speed, a three-year-old who, you know, his, his buyer figures at least they don't, really stand up, make him a major player in this race, but we'll see what happens. Um, you know, speed going two turns on the dirt at Del Mar or at uh, Santa Anita rather does usually really well. Defund is looking very comfortable here. Um, Country Grammar is in a great spot. Royal Ship is right there with him. The two of them have a nice battle. Tripoli's there. Azul Coast way at the back with high connection. Those are the two Bafferts that were very high odds that people didn't really give a strong consideration here. Um, all right, Express Train and Country Grammar better get going here. Defund is looking pretty. Maldonado's looking pretty comfortable on Defund. All right, he's going to go. Slow down, and he's going to challenge him. Um, Country Grammar needs to get his butt moving there. It's the worst. Man, he's. It's, I didn't like him because he's not. I don't think he's a mile and eighth horse. He's a mile and a quarter grinder type. Slow down, Andy. Slow down, he's going to try and take this lead here. Defund is not fighting. He's not giving it. Come on, is Country Grammar going to come after these two? He's not making up enough space there. Oh, boy. The fund is going to win this thing, Gate to Wire. Wow. Yeah, exactly how we all drew it up, right? Man, Maldonado on a speed horse for Baffert. Look out. Tends to work out pretty well. Eighth uh, record, eighth win for Bob Baffert, who now has, for the Breeders' Cup Classic, defunded. Country Grammar gets second. You assume he's going to go there. Probably got a good chance to get second. Taba. That's a pretty good trio. Code of the Breeders Cup Classic for Bob Baffert. Uh, oh, boy. Express Train, you know, I really thought he'd give a better effort. Second off the layoff. Pacific Classic, probably a bit too much for him coming back. He likes Santa Anita. He didn't, uh, I don't know. I don't see any excuses for him from this race. He just didn't fire. Uh, Royal Ship, interesting. Watching the head on here now, Royal Ship actually got pinched back to the rear and had to make up ground. He still wasn't a factor. His best days might be behind him. He's older gelding. Um, yeah, he might. I don't know. I don't know how much he. Well, we'll see. This was a great one race. We'll see what uh, we'll see what happens in the winter time. Boy, what I don't know. What did you think? It's kind of took me by surprise here. Didn't see the fun to doing this, but what did you think? Let me know down in the comment section below. Hit like before you leave. Subscribe to youtubecom slash racing dudes. And don't forget all the Breeders' Cup coverage for the prep races leading up to the World Championships. All at racingdudes.com. We'll see you there.